Virgos, hey, welcome back to Tarot Tea with Empress Meek. This is a channel of high vibrations, motivation, healing, acceleration, love, and light. I hope you guys are feeling really, really well. Thank you for joining me over here to our new channel. Let me go ahead and dive right into your reading. Spirit, thank you so much, Holy Spirit, for bringing me here with my Virgos. Thank you for all you're doing in the divine realm, seeing and unseen blessings you bestow upon us each and every day. And thank you for keeping us all under your divine hand of protection, blocking witchcraft and wickedness, anything that may be coming up against your divine will for our lives. We appreciate you giving us victory in every situation we may face and healing us in our hearts, minds, bodies, souls, and spirits. Amen, amen, and amen. <laughs> All right, guys, let's dive in. So let's see what message of spirit has for you today regarding matters of the heart. Thank you, ancestors and spirit guides, for bringing me here with my amazing soul tribe, my Virgos. What's going on? Let's see. Hi, Virgos, and I hope you're doing well. I appreciate your likes, shares, and subscribes. And go ahead and talk to me in the comments and let me know what you think about our new channel. All right, so we got weight. Don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. Okay, when it comes to matters of intertwining, stability, and long-term investment with someone with all this greenery and this card. I love these cards. They're so pretty. Let's see what else is here from my Virgos, my sisters and brothers. Oh, my goodness. Somebody may be having trouble with communicating. Um, the cards just fell out everywhere. <laughs> so, I mean, it could be me, but I don't, it usually doesn't really do that. Not all of them. So, there could be trouble communicating somewhere along the line. Let's see what this one says. Here's the picture. So, more stability. Um, yeah, I feel like you're, you're focusing on your stability. There's a lot of growth surrounding you. A lot of opportunities for growth and success longevity okay and look at the gold in the bottom and wealth okay and you like amazing i feel like some of you like very nice things you don't mind investing when it's something very nice luxury okay it says manifesting miracles your dream is soon to become a reality trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance Ooh, yes virgo that's what you're talking about Let's see what else. Somebody is manifesting money. Somebody is manifesting love. Somebody is manifesting a new business, fame. Somebody wants to be a star, okay? You better keep going, Virgo. You know it's Virgo stars out there, and we shine so bright. Yes. I ain't even going to start naming them. Y'all can name them in the comments. What Virgo stars do you know? Everybody know Beyonce. Stop it. Michael Jackson, that was easy. All right, come on, give me something else. <laughs> Forgiveness. All right, somebody here may want your forgiveness or you may have a situation that is calling for your forgiveness and compassion, a bit of empathy and understanding. Okay, let's read it. They tried to get away from me, but you fighting this forgiveness. Who is this you don't want to forgive? Come on. Let's vibrate high, open up that heart to love and wealth. Forgiveness. Stop focusing your energy on past events, for life is too precious to waste. You create your reality by what you think dream and imagine so let's start today and focus our minds on everything that we want okay not everything that we no longer have oh at the bottom of the deck we got soulmate here ah uh, somebody wanted this soulmate your soulmate is already with you in spirit believe this and they will manifest physically all right so spirit is healing some hearts today and making you aware of all the blessings you have right in front of your face so let's see what else is here. Thank you so much, spirit and ancestors and guides, holy angels, for being here with my Virgos. Tell Virgo what else they need to know about this energy that is coming toward them or surrounding them. We're going to use the Lenormand. I was just trying to use the Lenormand. So we're going to use this and then we're going to clarify with the Tarot for my Virgos. Thank you so much, spirit. Let's see. They said cut the card. Every now and again, I get that. So, okay, we'll cut them. These two don't want to come. You're being strong when it comes to challenges. They didn't want to get picked up. All right, so let's see. This is something that you're not exposing to people. That's why. All right, for Virgos. You ready? Okay, we have a single lady here. Oh, I'm a single lady. Oh, I'm a single lady. Okay, we got a single lady here. 
somebody who is beautiful, charming, very attractive, a go-getter, somebody that is seeking. I feel like somebody is waiting. Somebody is in expectation also of better, of more. Somebody is feeling like they already have the love they seek, so they're staying put. I see that here. Somebody is preserving their sexy and not really in a rush. Oh, star. Guarantee success. It just flipped over from the little tea leaf card. So maybe they want to come out. I'll get some. Let's see. But this person, you could be a star. Um, you could be very successful. We're just going to put this right here. Okay. When did it come out? So let's see what else. Oh, somebody is waiting for love. Seeking your love. This is a divine connection, a commitment, long term. This could also be talking about um, you making a solid foundation um, or connecting with new business partners, new endeavors, just things for you to be compassionate about or things for you to invest your heart and time into. Um, compassion and passion, something that you're passionate about. I feel like somebody is waiting on love, though. Um, but your expectation of beautiful things to happen, things that you can commit to, Things that's going to bring you joy and a sense of belonging, okay? Whatever this may be. This could be work, love, or life. But this is guaranteed success here. Hmm. Wait a minute. No, it's not. It's in the reverse. So it flew out in the reverse. So this would, this would not guarantee success, but this would um solidify like um solid foundations and Things happening well for you in this matter. Um, and the matter that this is talking about is love. So somebody is seeking love. They're feeling like they don't have the stability they want when it comes to love, whatever love this is. So um, let's see exactly what Spirit is trying to tell you. Um, but I also feel like you're going to have good luck in love. This is at the bottom of the deck. So when it comes to love, you will have success. Um you some of you are celibate some of you are waiting that's why you're waiting some of you are waiting for the right person you don't have to be a female um just a really gentle energy somebody that is very um caring loving taking care of themselves um this could be some of my male virgos also who are you know not in your so much masculine energy you could be very easygoing and kind-hearted you know and like i said someone has a purity about them or somebody is celibate Okay, but let's see what's going on. Somebody is very unblessed and abundant. This is a guaranteed um, success. This is guaranteed success here. And this is um, reassurance that things are about to be looking up for you. A lot of luck and beautiful things are going to happen to you or for you regarding love. So let's see. Let's get into your tarot spread and see what spirit is telling you today. Um, what deck should we use? Hmm. Okay, we already have some face cards here, so let's use this deck. We're going to use the Holy Grail Tarot. Spirit, thank you so much for being here with us today, helping me provide light and reassurance to my Virgos. What messages do you have for Virgo regarding this situation in love? Um, Somebody could definitely be waiting for their soulmate. Somebody could know that they don't want to invest in these things out here. Somebody has money, solid foundation coming toward them, even marriage, okay? This is growth, potential, and spiritual manifestation. Some of you have manifested this um, beautiful life. Somebody has changed their life. All right, a lot of things are happening for you at this time. Um, somebody definitely has wealth coming, all right? <laughs> if this was the general tarot, it would be a huge coin on this card, signifying you bringing in abundance and your wishes granted. Some of you are going to be famous and successful. Some of your businesses are going to flourish. You're going to be way more successful than you expected. All right, so definitely set the bar high. Um, and don't be sad when it comes to loving you not having what you want. Um, again, we have this, you need to be strong, um, and it's a need for you to be ambitious and confident. It's a need for you to be successful, and I see you going for that. Um, be self-assured, be a leader in this king and queen of um, wands energy here. Um, we also have the strength card, fortitude, resilience, and self-discipline is what it's going to take for you to achieve this goal that you have, especially in love, but you have guaranteed success here. And you also have the clover card. So this is definitely success. 
And then we have Knight of Cups here, a charmer, creative, and dreamy. Also, the Queen of Wands is here on the board. So we have you driven, um, passionate, come um, and definitely magnetic with this intoxicating love energy you got around you. Oh my god. Okay. So I mean, and this is some of my masculines here. I see my feminists here. You guys are being reassured that you have love and success. You have a feeling about this, but reassurance is always good. And this reading is reassuring you today. Six of Pentacles, balance and selflessness. I feel like you are selfless. You'll give your all when it comes to somebody that you truly love and you feel like you're getting it in return. Um, yeah, but you are about to give an equal give and take. Spirit is telling you to be strong while you're waiting. Okay. Wow. This flew over here. Let's see. Five of Pentacles. Yeah. It's taking you to be very strong because you feel left out right now. Some of you feel very discontent when it comes to your love life. A lot of you have the abundance and stability that you want. But when it comes to love, there's no stability there. A lot of in and outs, a lot of false starts, you know, and you're just sick of it. <laughs> Some of you... um are moving on to a calm water and you have found love with this knight of cups energy this is somebody being romantic charming you um romantic proposals and moving on to calmer waters from the difficulties that you've had some of you are no longer feeling this five of cups energy because it's trumped by the six of swords and the knight of cups so somebody has been giving you the love the compassion and the attention that you seek for some of you for some of you you've been pouring this energy into yourself anything else for the Virgo spirit Yeah, there's been some conflict and fighting when it comes to this um, connection for some of you um, where you feel like it's no stability here. So I feel like a lot of um, a lot of these false starts and different um, people that aren't quite right for you, you know, you're appreciating the good times that you can experience and you're trying to look at the whole experience as a positive. But at the same time, you're a little bit conflicted men mentally because you want to know why it's taking so long. <laughs> um, when it comes to you disagreeing with these people also with this love that you have that is unstable person keeps you waiting in expectation looking out wondering um, and it's giving you too much conflict it's causing too much confusion it's making you in this energy where you have to argue you know and become defensive and then you have to stand your ground and all this and you're blocking that out some of you are like I said defensive um, it makes you on guard, you know, all these different people doing these different things. And it makes you wonder, like, is there somebody real out there for me? And Spirit is saying, yes, be strong. You're going to have good luck and success and love. You're going to have the solid foundation, the money and the life you want. It's going to come in. Okay. So hold on, Virgo. Keep the faith. Um, let's see. Anything else for, for Virgo? Yeah transition release so spirit is telling you to release conflict release um being defensive and not paying attention to things so you can get this love that you want if you want your justice at the bottom of the deck this is what you need to do yes be confident spirit is saying because you have a new beginning coming so you have to be ready all right so these readings should be building you up getting you ready for that it should help you um defeat this self-doubt come out of your head it, help, it should help you be a little bit calm and easy when you come into these people because you know a little bit more to expect all right and for my new virgos here make sure you go check out our other virgo channel closer to my destiny's t it's closer to the number two my destiny's t okay um, and you can find it under the channel tab if you look on the channel tab in this um, in the ch and on this channel. All right, my lovey. So I love you. If you need a reading, a personal reading that tailors more to your story, you can email me. My email address is closer, the number two, my destiny, the number one at gmail.com. And I'm sending you my love, light, and positive energy. I love you and I mean it. I will see you on the next video. Bye, Virgo.